Today, we are fishing a all-day tournament on the river. Oh, there's one. Oh, we're on. Oh, we're on. We're hooked up. Got him. Yes, that's a good one. Just kidding. What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video today. We're out here and today we're gonna be fishing a springtime tournament on the river. So we're out here with Avery, who's gonna be my tournament partner for the day. And we are in hopes of a tournament victory because the last tournament we fished, we came up a tad bit short, okay? We were what, two, two pounds? pounds? Two pounds, one more fish might've taken it home for us. And we were so close, we had a decent bag and uh, we caught some good fish. Well, I actually caught some good fish. Avery said that she is going to catch at least two keepers today and uh, obviously five fish limit and weigh in is at three o'clock. So daylight to three o'clock, we have the fish and we're gonna hope that we catch a big one on top water or a big one in general. So you ready? Yay. <laughs> Teamwork, we've been up since three o'clock. So hopefully we catch some fish. I actually didn't sleep. <laughs> Yeah, Avery stayed up all night, so this is going to be a very interesting tournament. We'll see you guys out on the boat. All right, we've made it out to the first spot of the day. As you guys can tell, it is super foggy. We just ran through all that. Almost couldn't find the area we wanted to start in, but we're here, five fish limit, 12 inchers. We gotta get five, Avery. Honestly, if we don't win, I don't really care. You know, it's just fun getting out here and fishing these tournaments, but I also do wanna catch five fish just for like a personal goal. So we're gonna get to casting and hope that we can uh, find some fish. All right, Avery, we're both going to throw something different. I want you to start off with a spinner bait. Remember how to use this? Just toss it up there and reel. All right, all right, all right. You start off with that, and I'm going to throw top water. We need five fish. That's all we need. Come on, fish. We need five of you. This is a good little start off area, not because it's like we've caught fish here in the past, but because it's so foggy that I don't even want to run down the river. So I think starting here is perfect. We'll just see what happens. Oh, I'm on. We're hooked up. We are hooked up. Please be 12. Oh yeah, he'll keep. He'll keep. All righty. We're cooking already. We are cooking already. Let's go. Heck yeah. Oh, well, there we go. First fish to start off the tournament. I think that was maybe like five or six casts with the buzz bait back here. And uh, we have nice water temperatures at 70 degrees. They should be uh, feeding and they're eating top water. So that's what I've been catching them on every time I've come out here. I actually fished out here not too long ago. Did pretty decent, but uh, first little keeper of the day. Nothing crazy, he's not gonna win this thing, but we just gotta add on to him. These are our, our we gotta get our four and then we need a big five and we'll be chilling. But we're gonna go ahead and get him uh, tagged up and tossed into the live well. Clip him on, we're gonna toss him in there and hopefully add him to friends. Ugh, good job, let's go. Good job, good stuff. All right, good stuff, Avery. We already got one, now we just need four more. It's always good to pull up to the first spot of the day and catch a fish. So me and Avery have already game planned what, what our plan was. I'm gonna power fish a lot, so I'm probably gonna have a top water rod in my hand probably 90% of the day. And then she's gonna throw something either kind of a little bit under like a spinnerbait or a jig whenever we get out on the main river. But like I said, it's just super foggy at the moment. So we're staying inside this creek and then uh, hopefully later we can catch some fish out in the main stuff. But this is always a good little spot. Huh? Did you just have a bite? Yeah, he came right up on it, but didn't touch it. How big did he look? Did he look bigger than the one I caught? I mean, like he when he bumped it, like, I can feel it. Okay, good. There's fish in here. Gotta keep the net ready in case a big one gets hooked up. Because we cannot afford to lose one today. Every bite counts. Oh, we're on. We're hooked up. 
Got him. Yes, that's a good one. I'm just gonna flip him. Stay on, buddy. Stay on. That's a really decent one. Oh gosh. We might need the net. It's gonna have to be quick. Just kidding. Woo! Yep. I, I was I was too scared. I was like, I don't like him being hooked for that long. Holy crap. This is a really good fish. Wow. <laughs> Woo! Give me some team. We're a team, Avery. You're gonna I catch know we're them. A team. You want a top water bait? I'll hook you up yes, with a top water I'm bait. Fun. Well, that is a nice fish right there. Absolutely crushed the buzz bait. The way he hit it, I didn't think he was this big, but he just started digging down straight into the brush paw. I mean, I literally thought there was gonna be one there. I was like, there's gotta be one near that brush. Even might be kind of in a spawning mode right there. Kind of some bloody tail. And uh, they would push up in the creek like this. So we're going to get them in the live well and keep stacking on this bag. But this is a really, really nice fish. Great contribute to our bag. Oh, yes. Yes. We needed that, Avery. We got up at 3 o'clock in the morning. We need some fish on the board. Let's go. All right. So you're going to cast it out there. You're going to kind of reel it so it's like pointing at you. And you're going to kind of flick it down. See? Just kind of. You know you're doing it right when it's. Kind of makes that. Okay. And just reel it every time you get it. Yeah, basically this is more like a like a pause kind of game. So you'll twitch it, sit there for a second, twitch it, sit there for a second, twitch it, sit there for a second. You can also do it like multiple times and then sit it. But that's kind of the action you want. Yeah, I was like, I just had a flashback in my head of how many fish I've been missing on the buzz bait. And I was like, at any second, this fish will pop off. So I was just like, you know what? I got the green muscle rod. I'm just sending them, sending them straight into the boat. They've just been kind of slurping my buzz bait. I don't really know if I've had like a crazy top water eat. Like they've been eating it, but just kind of grabbed it, you know? Nothing like throwing themselves on it like I really like them to be. But hey, if, as long as they're getting hooked, I don't care what they do. Imagine we get five fish in this one creek. That'd be so amazing. The rest of the day would be so smooth. Oh, that's nice out this morning. Fresh air, big bass blow ups. I mean, what more did you want? I, I just think we start working our way out. I mean, cause we're gonna come back to this for sure. Oh, I'm on. I just came up. No, you're still on. We're hooked up. Yes. 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 Oh, that was a good one. It's like a two and a half. Oh my gosh. You're gonna be kidding me. All right, you ready? All right, well, first creek, we have two fish. We have a nice one. A small spotted bass and then i lost one right at the boat still pretty angry about that it was a nice little frog bite probably a two and a half pounder <sighs> not great but i'm gonna quit talking we're gonna get to the next spot we gotta keep the lures in the water today to increase our chances of some big bites prioritize the right side that's i've had a lot of luck over there in the past like up under these trees like i said we're probably gonna kind of cruise through this just because i want to fish the main river for the generation kicks on Oh, my fish. you're so quiet. I, I just never know, know when you catch one. <laughs> yeah. I turn around and I just see the rod bent over. Oh my gosh. Oh, he's tiny. Dang it. There's literally 12 on the dot. Good work. Yay. Not really contributing much, but hey, he is a 12 incher. All right, I'm putting him on number two. Remember that. Okay. Two is the tiny one because he is too tiny. We have to get rid of him. But he is a fish. All right, that's three. Two more and we'll have a limit. And we just gotta get rid of the one that you caught. <laughs> we gotta get him out of there. He don't belong in there. All right, I'm making one more cast. Stay on, buddy. Stay on. 
Stay on. Get up here. Yes. <laughs> we needed that. All right, little spotted bass. You will be our, what, fourth fish? That's four. Gosh, he just threw himself on it. Man, that is sick. Not a, not a big one, but hey, he is a fourth fish. We're going to get him back in there, and we're going to keep working this bank line and see if we can't maybe find some more. See you, buddy. Ooh, wild. I'm feeling good, Avery. We got four. We need five, and then we got to get your little one gone. And then if we could get rid of those spots, we'd be in business. We have a lot of fish in the head of us today, so we're in a good position. We're in a good position. We just need one more to get that five fish limit. Yeah, I saw that like change of color up there on the bank, and I was like, I'm about to cast it that. And when I when I got over it, it just boom hit me and took me up under that stick. That could have been bad. I'm surprised it didn't get off, honestly. All right, I'm about to get me the Texas rig tied up so I can flip around one, two. I think I'm gonna go with the the cover crawl here. Just feel like this thing, mm, I don't know. What should I throw, Avery? Cover crawl? Yeah. All right, I'll throw it around for a little while and see what I can do with it. Worst comes to worst, I'll tie up a bandito bug. I'm trying to give them something they've never seen. Oh, you got one. Mm, I don't know if he's gonna keep. <sighs> oh. Hey, that's the second fish though. Yeah, got your little bite. Yeah, he's probably not a keep. Yeah, he's definitely not gonna keep. He's a 10 incher. See ya, buddy. <laughs> you got one? Do you think he's gonna keep? No. Another 10. He's like a 10 and a half. You wanna throw him back or you want me to? Or hooked up. Got him. Oh, that's a decent one. Yes. That's the fifth one, right? Oh, he's not fat, but he is long. Get up here. That's a keeper. We have five, Avery. We have five. Nothing crazy. He's not really going to help us, but hey, he is a fifth fish. So we have called a five fish limit, and we still have all day to call some fish out. So I'm feeling good. Avery, how are you feeling? Cool. Cool. No comment. Cool. All right. We're going to put you on one. We got to get rid of two. They're going crazy in there. All right, we got five. Good stuff. We gotta have a, a team handshake. Look, check me out. Check me out. Look, 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 look. Hand. Look, no, no, no. I thought that was pretty cool. <laughs> Good job. All righty, cover crawl. Waxed one. He actually threw my cover crawl off, and I saw it fall, but I don't know where it went. Do you see it up here? He threw my crawl off. Oh, he threw it off on the cooler. So we'll go black and blue bandito bug. Can't beat it. Oh, it's raining. Sick. <laughs> oh, gosh. All right, so we have currently taken cover underneath a nice set of trees because it is raining. It wasn't even supposed to rain today. But uh, it is currently pouring down some rain. Uh, it's supposed to stop here soon, so that's good. But we're just, uh, we're snacking, right? Mm -hmm. We're snacking, and uh, we have five fish, which is a very good thing. We just got to get rid of one for sure, and maybe two or three. We need to get rid of all of our spotted bass, but we do have five. That was the goal for today. We still have a lot of time left throughout the day, so we're going to keep fishing, try and hit it, try and make some coals, and see what we can do. All right, looks like the rain is stopping, so that means we're getting back out there. You on? Yeah. Good one? Definitely think it's a keeper. 11. You're getting closer. That's one. There we go. Got him. God, I don't think he's gonna keep either. <coughs> I'd be surprised. You look a lot different than the one that we just had. This is a weird looking spot. Wow, back to back bites of little spotted bass that just don't make the cut There's one. ain't gonna do it ain't gonna do it oh boy we gotta escape these little spotted bass well eh, he might be 12. he's gonna be very close to the one we got a cold though so i don't even know got him right in the top of the dome piece though 10 incher bye We're hooked up. I don't know 
if he's gonna keep. Get up here. He's got the most potential out of any of them we've pulled up in the past few minutes or hours or whatever, how long we've been on this bank. Dang, I thought we were gonna have a coal there. All right, Avery's hooked up. Toss him up here. That literally looks like the same exact fish. I ain't even gonna lie. Well, he for sure ain't gonna help us. I don't know. I don't think he's the same. He's close though. See ya. Oh my gosh. It's like me and you will both like we'll get up on some and they'll all just be small. <laughs> like we literally just caught those pretty much back to back, like in a time frame of two or three minutes. All right, Avery, we need to lock in, all right? We need to get that little guy out of the live well. We need to catch an eight, a seven. I'm $60 deep right now, plus snacks. I'm basically poor. So like we have to win this or I'm homeless. So like we, we just gotta, we gotta find that big one. We just got to. Nice skip, nice skip. Wow, I'm, I am locked in. I think we're about to swap sides in a second. It's not like this side's been producing anything with size for us, you know? Might as well go try the other side and see what we can do. Cover some water. Oh, I got a fish. He's swimming with it. We're hooked up. Not going to help us. Not even a little bit. Well, like I said, not producing any size. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. You just do not do it for us. Go tell your big dog friends to uh, come bite my lure. See ya. Man, he was taking off with that thing. See, I hate to leave this side because there's fish, but like... They're so tiny. Oh, there's one. Got him. On the swim bait. Oh, that's decent. That's decent. That's definitely an improvement. I think it's a large mouth. Let's go up here. It's a... Uh, I don't think it's going to be an improvement. Oh, we need an improvement. Not even close. See ya. Oh, oh got him. He's not going to help either. Oh, he's even smaller. <sighs> Man, it's good we're getting bites, but they're not the bites we really need. There's one. Got him. Ah. Oh. Eleven. See ya. Gosh. Oh, there's one. That one feels decent, actually. Oh, uh, he's a largey, I think. Mm, maybe not. Gosh. Nope. Spotted bass. He's fat. <laughs> well, this has been our problem for the past two or three hours. We're catching fish. We're catching a lot of fish. They are just in the 10 and 11 inch range. We need 12 and we don't want 12. We need like a 13, a 14, a 15. We need some, some length here. We're catching all these tiny spotted bass. It's driving us crazy. We need a coal out of fish. We can't do it. So uh, I think we've both made the decision. It's hot. We want to go fish in some creeks. That's where we had the best luck. So uh, we're about to go ahead and do that. So we've been catching them on the black and blue jig, the black and blue bandito bug, even the love grub right here. And uh, the cool thing about that is code Logan saves 10% at checkout. Uh, anyways, we've just been getting bites. Um, they just haven't been the ones we've been wanting. So I'm gonna wrap up fishing this, uh, this nice tree right here we have coming up in the shade. And then me and Avery are gonna go and fish the creeks. And if we don't catch anything to coal out at least we'll be a little bit cooler in the creeks so i guess that's a plus but we just have not found the size we've been looking for and knowing these guys out here these guys are some local hammers and uh what we have ain't gonna do it so we're gonna keep fishing hard and we're gonna hope for the best but we will see you guys probably in the next spot because i'm about to make like max three casts right here and we are gonna move i mean it looks great there's just no big fish so we are currently on the struggle bus for the size, but we will see. See you guys on the next spot, though.
All right, so it is currently about roughly 40 something minutes before weigh-in and uh, we have literally done everything we can do. We have fished every creek, every bait. We've hit the best spots. It just turned off on us and we honestly didn't have the biggest fish, the ones we really wanted, but I did want to show you guys the lures that caught them today and uh, these have been my favorite spring lures on the river. So maybe it can help you guys go out and catch some fish. My number one bait right here. I absolutely love this thing this time of the year, whether it's spring, summertime, fall even. The black buzz bait. It's kind of a strange color. I know that white is probably a little bit more popular, but the black and the gold blade is just, it's perfect. Next up, we have the top order frog. I like the popping frog, walks better, and uh, you can kind of give this thing a nice little pause. And it's also weedless, but this uh, this kind of let me down today. We did lose one at the boat. He was, he was pretty good. He definitely would have contributed nicely to our bag. But he did get off. But a frog and a buzz bait, two of my favorite top orders of all time. You just can't go wrong. Last but not least, they are all gone. The black and blue bandito bug. You just can't beat this soft plastic. And they absolutely chew this thing up in the river. We caught a lot on them today. They just were not the size we wanted. But we're gonna see what we can do. We're gonna head to weigh in with our five fish, which is a good little uh, good little goal for us. Good job, partner. Yeah, good stuff, good stuff, even though you're falling asleep on me over there. But it's been a long day, so I'm pretty proud of our five fish. We're in a whale man with pride and see what happens. All right, starting off smallest. Wow, they are feisty in here. Wow. Smallest one of the day, caught by Avery. Not bad. Nice little spotted bass. Jeez. Got another one. That's not a bad one. All right here. Oh dang, that's a little bit bigger than I thought it was. Yes, tear my thumb all the way up. Not a bad fish. You got a big one. Uh, I got a nice one. I don't know if I'd call him a big one. I will weigh him. He is 321. Y'all catch a bunch of spots today? Oh yeah, so Man, many. I bet you I caught 40 of them. We, I, we caught them right between 10 and 11. Uh-huh. <laughs> bunch of them. Okay. Yeah. Come on, come on. Strictly spots. Come on. Quit. 742. 742 total, little guy. Decent little largey. Little spot. All right here, a nice little three. Seven six, I think. Nice fish. We're gonna get it back. Well, right there, we just got done fishing the tournament. This was Avery's first time fishing a morning slash kind of all day tournament. We fished from Safe Light, which I think was at 5:40 this morning, to uh, three o'clock, and that honestly takes a lot out of you, especially when the heat is so bad, the sun is blazing down on you, and especially when the bite is slow. We actually started off pretty good. I was feeling really nice. Then uh, we missed one on the frog, and ever since that happened, the rest of the day just started kind of going downhill. But I am proud. We caught five fish, which was our goal today, and it was just to come out, catch fish, and have fun, and that is exactly what we did. And uh, we just couldn't escape the small spotted bass today. We caught probably 10 that we had to throw back because they just could not be kept. They weren't even 12 inches, and even if they were, we didn't want them. So it was a decent day. It was just fun getting out here and smoking some fish. But uh, it is nice to kind of look back on previous tournaments that I've fished in the past where I couldn't get a five fish limit. And now I have to struggle to cull fish out, which is, I guess, a good sign of improvement. But it was fun. If you guys want to see more tournament videos, drop a comment down below. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Stay fishing.